Okay, welcome back. Um, just to let you know that we've installed the compressor, as you can see, it's su super quiet. You can hardly hear it. I'm right next to it and I can hardly hear it. And this is the biggest system we sell, so it's a 36,000 BTU unit. So what it was, I want to want a quick chat, just talk about the how I put the bass down, because it's pretty straightforward. Um, there's a BC guide that basically gives you um, a best practice guide for sort of installing heat pumps and so on and so forth, and we'll put a link in the description. Now, what I did is I dug, dug down probably about four feet by two feet square, and about a couple of inches, not so much, and then I put some pea gravel down, and I compressed it with my feet, and just made sure it's quite level. And then what I did is I went to the hardware store, and I bought two sets of slabs. So I've got four slabs in total, put one slab on top of the other, and all together I've got about four inches of concrete depth with, between the two slabs. And then what I did is I got some, uh, call it landscaping cement, um, and it's basically for gluing concrete together. And what I did is I glued the two slabs together, um, and then I mounted on there some um, concrete block bricks or large bricks or whatever, and they lift the, they, again, they lift the condenser off the floor about four, four inches, and this allows things like leaves and that sort of stuff, snow maybe, um, to give it a bit of um, space so you can clear it out, because you don't want the condenser resting on the floor. Now this didn't take us too long, took me a couple of hours, I guess, and was pretty straightforward. You can put concrete down, but I found that, but you know, I found this easier, really, to be honest. So as you can see, you've got rubber feet, and these come with the kit, and that's what keeps it all quiet, stops any vibrations. And then all I used is a thing called Cobra screws, which are uh, basically concrete anchors. Uh, you don't need any plugs or anything. You drill a hole, and then the screw goes straight into the concrete block, and it holds it tight. And basically, I've got four blocks. Um, and that's really quite it, really. Um, it's, it's pretty simple. Um, but I like this arrangement because it's, it's flat, level, and um, yeah, it's easy. It's DIY.